uh, Rowdy Hardy, who has come from us and from New Mexico military. Uh, he played Division One baseball at Austin P. He was an All-American. He's in their Hall of Fame. And he's had the opportunity to pitch in the Kansas City Royals organization. He was organizational pitcher of the year in 07 and moved on with the Braves for the last couple of years. And we're real excited about adding him to our staff and our program. And we welcome Rowdy and his family here in Jonesboro. Uh, we feel like it's a great and exciting addition for us to move forward. And bring a lot of energy and passion about the game and want to teach, but also recruit and hustle on the road. So we're excited about I uh, heard about this job, you know, through the, through the whirlwinds and the coaches' connections and stuff. And I came out here from New Mexico Military Institute, a junior college out in Roswell, New Mexico. And Chris uh, Cook coached here. I guess that may have uh, had a little something to do with you finding out about it. A little bit. You know, I always heard the stories about Arkansas State. He really loved his time here for the, you know, the six years or so that he was here. So I heard the stories for about five years, and when, when I had an opportunity to, you know, hopefully come here, and which I ended up doing, I was really excited about it. Now you're a Tennessee guy, so you're gotten a little bit closer to home then too. Yeah, it's a lot closer to home, a lot closer to family. Instead of two plane rides, you know, it's a short car ride, so that always helps. Okay, now what are your goals and expectations for being the pitching coach for the Red Wolves? Well, you know, from what I hear from Coach Raffo and, you know, talking to guys and, you know, seeing some stuff online, this this is a staff that has some potential. Um, there's some really good arms that are older, junior, senior type guys. There's some really good new guys coming in, you know, especially some of the freshmen have a lot of potential. So it's about helping each guy find his unique uniqueness and his, uh, his talent for what he has and being able to be successful with all of them and you know see how much we can develop these guys you know in the fall to be competitive and good from the first game on in the spring. So I'm about to break up baseball league isn't it? Oh absolutely you're talking about the top top four or five teams in this league could probably compete with just about anybody in the nation it's it's really impressive that the level this this uh, conference has gotten to as far as baseball and it shows year in year out these guys are really good and it's going to be it's going to be exciting, you know, for our guys. I know they're ready as close as they got last year to a regional um, to come back and really try to get over that hump.